Hey everybody, Dave Basulto, FilmmakingCentral.com. We are back in Adobe Premiere Pro CS4. Today we're going to take a look at one of my absolute favorite parts of Premiere Pro, and that's the ClipNote review system they have. Uh, it's just made things so much easier for me, and uh, my clients actually really dig it. So um, if you haven't used it, today you're going to learn how, and it's a great, great addition to the um, whole workflow. So I put together some clips from my lovely artbeats.com footage. And as you can see, it's a little golf, three golf clips from my golf footage that everyone's seen. <laughs> um, so let's say I now am ready to send this to the client. Maybe I want to see what they think about the edit or if they want to add some stuff, whatever. All you do is go to File, Export, and then Adobe Clip Notes. Make sure that your sequence is selected. As you can see, I have sequence two selected. So I'm going to click Adobe Clip Notes. And then I'm going to uh, go through the export settings. So here I've got a format uh, on Mac. All I have is uh, Clip Notes QuickTime. No big deal. They can still see it. Uh, on presets, I've got the option of using uh, just my source NTSC or do I have widescreen uh, PAL, widescreen, widescreen PAL as well. Um, and then my kilobits per second. I have two choices there. Uh, what did I? No, oh, I didn't want that. I want this first one. And then um, I can put comments there, of course. Um, I'm exporting both uh, video and audio. I choose my output area. And then uh, when you normally export things, you'll see filters, video, audio, and others. Well, now you see a clip notes here as well. And there's several things that you can do here. Uh, video options. You have the choice of embedding the video, and that's something that I usually do. Uh, or you can stream it. So if you want to actually um, uh, pick streaming, you just click streaming, and then you go down below and put the URL to where you have uploaded the clip, and it'll stream. Um, if it's a big video and I don't want the clients getting upset, I might do stream. Um, you can password protect it, so I'll put my password in there. Confirm the password. Make sure you write it down because uh, you can forget it. <laughs> uh, and then here you can write your instructions if you have any instructions. Uh, this is just generic text that uh, comes with it, but I usually um, will add a couple things in here to uh, personalize it. And then very important, um, you want to in the return comments too. You want to put your email address in here. So I might do something like Clarity Pictures at mac.com it's my production company and then uh you just click ok it'll bring it up into the media encoder and it'll encode and create a pdf file so i've actually already done this so i'm going to hide the media encoder so this opens up and lets you know uh manage trust for multimedia content play at this time um or don't so i'm going to uh, choose play and as I said before, in the comments window, you could have left anything you wanted here. This is the generic stuff that um, comes with the Adobe Clip Notes. Um, so just click OK. And here your client or whoever is going to see, if they just play through, your files. And there's our footage. And then we switch into another one. So let's say he saw that and he wants to go back and he says... Um, Maybe right here, I want to um, add my logo. That's all I have to do. And then right here, um, let's, uh, uh, let's color correct this. And then over here, uh, we're going to put uh, add end credits. And that's it. Uh, he's going to put his name in here. Um, so it's going to be client. And now uh, if I just go in the bottom here, if I just scroll through, you'll see that all my notes are here. It's great. And now I'm just going to click export. And uh, I'm going to export these to my desktop. So I just have them there. And uh, I'm going to click no just for that. And uh, we're done. So if I just click uh, hide that for now, back in Adobe Premiere, if I go to File, uh, Import Clip Notes is not selected, so I have to click and select my sequence. 
go to file, import clip notes comments. And on my desktop, I am looking for this data XDF, XFDF file. Sorry. Click that, and it's imported. As you can see down here, I have chapter markers, or markers, I should say, that contain what my uh, notes are. So if I just double click on them, it says uh, add logo. Okay, great. So I know at this exact time point, the client wants me to add the logo. Uh, I can go to next, so I know down at this area, he wants me to color correct, and if I click next again, add credits, add end credits. So there you have it. Uh, it's really fast and wonderful to use this uh, to get exact information back from your client or um, your producer or whoever you're working with, or a director, anything. Uh, I love Adobe Clip Notes. Check them out, Adobe Premiere Pro CS4. I'm Dave Basulto. This is filmmakingcentral.com.